John and Chrissy are joining us now with their dogs, Petey and Penny. Yay. We are going to get your fur babies in a moment, but first, that song, you guys are celebrating 11 years yes. of marriage. Wow. Yep. What is it like to have a song written about you? I mean, it's really special and beautiful. When I first heard it, he was just whispering it into my ears, so I got very emotional from the very first sentence, and then it becomes everybody's song, yeah. and which is beautiful to pass it along, too. I think at his concerts, people love turning around and seeing if I'm going to cry, and I'm, <laughs> right, right, right. And I'm past that now. <laughs> right, right, right. You're like, every single time. <laughs> yeah, it, it, I know. Like, I just, like, oh, and, I, and then I have to pretend to, like, wipe the uh, oh. That's so funny. I just realized 11 years, 11 years, we're also, yeah. we're almost at 11. We, yeah, uh, we, we celebrated our big 10 year in September, oh, and so okay. we'll be 11 this coming yeah. September. Yep. That's wow. awesome. And together, how uh, long together? We started long. dating, we met <laughs> so in <long>. late 2006, <laughs> so oh. we've okay. known each other for almost 18 years. I actually yeah. remember, uh, for some reason, an Oscars red carpet, and you had, like, an orange yes. dress. Oh, yeah. Isn't that a crazy? Brown suit and I was on painkillers. Yeah. Yeah. I just had my wisdom teeth taken out, and so I just walked it like. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Larry? I remember that. No, that's that that crazy. Yeah. That was my first dress. Anyone Our let first me wear? Oscars together. Is that, was yeah. that the first Oscars? Well, yeah. I don't know why I remember that. Oh, yeah. 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 Um, and I, I love how the family's always together with your kids and, yeah. and, and the dogs. And you had your mom. Yes. Uh, she lived with you, right? Yes. yes. And she, for a long, long time. For a long Because her mother in law, we're so very similar at the time. Her mom lives with us, too, helping us with the kids. But yours recently moved. She did. She moved back to like the area she's from in northern Thailand oh, wow. all of she has this group of like 10 single lady friends from from elementary school wow. yeah, they've known each other forever so, yeah that. she is thriving we kind of wanted to let her go live her life like and and really be in the place that she loves with the people she loves we oh. miss her so much she still watches all the cameras. She has the Nest app. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And so, um, but we don't let we don't let her microphone in anymore. That's like creepy. I don't want the kids to think they're always being watched. That's funny. But they hold up signs to each other like like little hostages. So now she's like Aww. Ty Golden Girls. She, oh my God, she <laughs> really yes, is. Yes, Ty Golden Girls. <laughs> she that's is a good one. I go to her. Oh, sorry. Look at Peter. Hey, get in there. <laughs> I go to her Instagram, my water. and she is like. Queen of the, I mean, she's always doing something crazy. Yeah, Pepper, she, has, right? she has a lot of family yeah. there, a lot of friends cool. there, and we got to go there for spring break. Yes. And it was so fun. fun. That's awesome. Well, you guys have six. There's a, you're a family of six yes. now. Yes. You quickly went. Not, you have two babies. Yeah. Yes. Six quick. That are five months apart. Yes. yes. I can't even imagine. It's crazy, but they're creeping up to each other enough to where they seem like twins, twins. now. Yeah. yeah. He's not walking yet, and she's oh, look running. Oh, cute. That is cute. Yeah. <laughs> but it's oh so my They're cute. around the same size, which is weird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. Ren loves to eat. That boy oh can eat. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Get down he right there. <laughs> always something in his hands, yes. What are you guys planning for Mother's Day, John? Do you have anything special? Well, she likes to chill on Mother's yeah. Day. She doesn't like me to too. do too much. She's yeah. like, let me relax. Exactly. Um, and I give her the same gift every year. Year. I do like a yearbook, like a family, like kind of retrospective book um, that we keep, you know, they're all like the same format, they're all in the same bookcase, and so we'll just chronicle our lives that way, and we started when Luna was one, and so I, I've been doing that every year, and so that's the gift I give her. It's I very predictable, it. it's really but nice. it's very sentimental. And then I think we're going to drop by um, our friends at Flamingo Estate, and we're giving out um, blankets. Uh, to support a foundation called Elizabeth House on Mother's Day. So we're gonna be there for about an hour or yeah, two. Yeah, we're gonna hang out there. Yeah. I'll All the proceeds go to Elizabeth too, House. If she'll let me. Yeah, sometimes I feel like even the cooking though is a lot of pressure. Cause I'm like, look, I have to eat it and put on a big show <laughs> right, of how right, good right. it is. <laughs> I want zero pressure. Yeah. I want. Luna wants to make you breakfast, she told me. Yes. That's, that's super yeah. sweet. Mm -hmm. it, it's again so weird how similar, because I ask her, what do you, you know, what do you want from others? Every day it's the same thing. I just want to relax. I just want to yeah. go, like, be alone. I so, dang, be alone. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm be at the spa yeah. away from you guys. Yeah. I'm like, all right. <laughs> I know. I get it, man. I get they it. They want peace, is what they want. Don't they want it personally. Peace. I love yeah. you guys. Yeah. I've been taking it personal. Yeah, exactly. Um, you're also parents to uh, a few fur babies, two of which yeah. are obviously here with us. Penny, Penny and Petey, and Petey, Petey. are here. We've so got two more at home. And you have a new pet line called Kismet. Kismet, that's Correct. right. Tell, tell us about that. So Kismet is really all about the whole pet lifestyle, but the main centerpiece is we created a beautiful food for our dogs and for everybody's dogs. We've got a chicken and barley recipe, a salmon and brown rice recipe. We've got treats. With like sweet potato dehydrated nuggets. So they like really gravitate toward it. They love the mm. taste. It broke my heart that dogs were eating the same like 
just blah food for every, every meal of every day. I want them to enjoy it, but you want it to be nutritious and healthy for them too. And our dogs really truly love yeah. it. And every dog owner that we've talked to since we launched it, they're like, they. My dog's normally very picky, but mm -hmm. they really love Kismet. We wanted it to be delicious. Okay. We wanted to have all the nutrients they need. Yeah. We wanted to be just as nutritious as fresh food, but way more convenient and affordable. And right. we just. We're so proud of it okay. because I think we nailed the formula. <laughs> it's just right. And it's the he kind of ingredients that dogs really need and want. <laughs> and yeah. and they on. love it. Well, we got we got a few over at uh, Casa Lopez, and so we'll have to uh, well, good. We'll have to get it. To, love it. He likes to hug. Tell us about the He's products you guys brought. <laughs> Tell us about the products you brought. We brought food, we brought treats, treats. but we also have merch and everything too. Like oh, okay. for, for for our humans well, and for dogs, we yeah. have merch and. Uh, KismetPets.com has everything on the website. Right on, guys. Congrats on that. And, and John, I know we just we just learned that. Uh, Look at this guy. This dog, this dog, by the way, this dog. He loves her so much. This dog looks like there's a person inside. He's dressed as a dog. He actually, so he does this hug all day on me. He so bruised my eyes. He's eye, obsessed with her. And everyone's like, oh, a Botox bruise. And I'm yeah. like, no, I do get Botox there. But this is from my dog. So funny. I'm going to say he did this to me. I yeah, exactly. Right here. Just don't blame the husbands. That's all right. Right, right exactly. Do they sleep with you? Uh, oh, yeah, what do you guys think about the dogs yeah. on the bed? He's not a good um, sleeper with us because he's too big, but yeah. Pearl can and Penny can. Penny's very good. Pearl's a good cuddler, but she has to get up really early. Pearl's our basset hound. hound. Yeah. And then uh, oh, a basset uh, hound too. two oh of the dogs God. are not wow. really good for the bed, and, and Pearl and Penny are. are if our, our dogs girl. didn't snore, I'd let them sleep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so Frenchies they, are they, crazy. They're so well, crazy. They're short yeah. Short they're short. Dogs. And then yeah. they're, they're yeah. blowing yeah. it up and snoring yeah. at the same time, so it's, <laughs> it's an awful too. combo. What do you mean I do that, too? This one blows it up like crazy all the time. And in the cars, I'm like, oh, my God. And we can tell the different farts. You can tell. We know who's doing it. They're distinct. They're distinct. I get blamed, and it's the dog. It's you. Oh, okay. It's also a good out if you do. That's true. That's oh, true. That's why I let him kick it, it, but then yes. we sleep Blame we go away. Dog. Great. Blame the dog. Great. I could sit Blame here and see children. how he did you dirty. We <laughs> I could sit here and talk to you guys <laughs> forever. <laughs> Chrissy and John, thank you so much for coming. For more information about the Kismet Pet Line, please visit the Kismet Pets website.